If you have a Game Pass subscription and also a membership on Battle.net, which of course, as you know, is totally free. It's a bit like Steam. If you've ever had Call of Duty or whatever, then you will have had or you will have a Battle.net account. Here's the thing. If you connect your Battle.net account with your Xbox account, with your Game Pass account, and you have a GeForce Now account, <laughs> you can play it on GeForce Now as part go. of Battle.net. So you don't yeah. even you don't need to own the game. You just need and and even though it hasn't yet come out on Xbox, mm. <laughs> you can still play it. So and um, always crank this, crank your settings up the ultra, folks, and enjoy it. It looks beautiful and amazing. Well, let's have a look because this is how you do it, Ray. For those that uh, I I only know this because I didn't I did it myself today. So he goes to your Battle.net account, mm -hmm. which in this case is this one, and you go to account settings. Yep. in the corner there uh oh look at that you have to sign in again which is all cool because i know you can't see your password you can't and i know what it is so in we go once you're in your settings you want to, on the mm. left hand side go to connections and in here you want to make sure if it isn't already the xbox network is mm -hmm. connected so just click on connect you have to sign into xbox da -de 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 da job done and that's all you have to do. You then go that's across, it. go across to GeForce now, which I happen to have here, and uh, find yourself a Diablo. There it is, and make sure you select if you don't already Battle.net. Battle.net. So if you've got it already, if you own the game already, then and you've been playing it on Steam, it doesn't matter any any uh, jot. But if you like me, you don't, and it's on Game Pass. Click it on the old Battle.net there, and you're good to go. 